Welcome to this week's Z Code System football video here on YouTube. And if you're watching on the Z Code System blog, we're going to be talking today about the conference championship games, which come up this coming Sunday as the Tennessee Titans head to Arrowhead Stadium to take on the Kansas City Chiefs. And over in the NFC, we see the Packers going out to San Francisco to play the 49ers in the NFC Championship game. It's a big weekend of NFL football and two very contrasting championship games as we get closer to the Super Bowl. Guys, don't forget to go over to the Z Code System blog and to read up on all the things that we have going on over there. Of course, you can read the blogs for our picks on the, NF, uh, the NFL Championship games, which are coming up. And you can get the picks for the upcoming NBA games or NHL games that are also happening this week. And as you can see right there on your screen, we are introducing the new Sports Trader Platform 2.0 for 2020. So don't miss out on that. Go to the blog, read up on that, and sign up to Z Code System and be able to use all of the fantastic tools that we have there. And go over to the VIP and you can get the picks for whichever sports that you like to bet on and that you invest in. And you will also be able to use the various Z Code systems for making your educated sports bets and investments. So do that now and get onto this before this weekend's NFL action. Now, let's head over to the VIP wall where we will look at our VIP picks and I'll talk you through a few of these uh, picks and the games that are going on on Sunday. All right, so here we have the Tennessee Titans taking on the Kansas City Chiefs coming up at Arrowhead on Sunday. Now, the Titans have been fantastic as of late. Three straight wins, as you can see right there. And even though they barely got into the playoffs, they have been red hot since getting in. They beat the New England Patriots. And that was a massive upset, as we all know. Uh, even though the Patriots still had to play in that wild card round, I, you know, based on history and Tom Brady and Bill Belichick, I expected the Patriots to at least make it to the AFC Championship game. That has not happened. The Titans knocked them off, uh, winning there in Foxborough and uh, 20 to 13. And then, even more shockingly, the Tennessee Titans went to Baltimore and dominated the Ravens 28 to 12, completely shut down that Ravens offense. Okay, so the Titans will be taking on the Kansas City Chiefs, the favored Kansas City Chiefs who came from 21 points down in the first quarter. Let's go over that again. They were down 21 points after 15 minutes to come back to win 51-31 against the Houston Texans. And as you can see, the Chiefs also red hot. Fantastic way that they have been playing football uh, as of late. Now, these two teams do have history this season. The Chiefs went to Tennessee, and I'll bring that up right here on the head-to-head. -head. Uh, the Chiefs went to Nashville and played the Titans earlier this season. And as you can see there, back in November, they lost 35-32. Titans have won back-to-back -back times against the Kansas City Chiefs. And as you can see there, that would have been uh, back in the 2017-2018 playoffs. So the Chiefs, not a great head-to-head -head record in their last two games against the Tennessee Titans. Very close games. Uh, wins for the Titans with uh, by three points or less there, as you can see. So the Titans have form going in, and they have beaten the Chiefs already this season, as I just said. Now, the problem with that, the Titans, uh, excuse me, the problem with that is the Texans had also beaten the Chiefs earlier this season at Arrowhead. And the Chiefs, as you saw last week, winning 51-31. Now, that was almost, almost didn't happen because the Texans did have that 21 point lead after the first quarter. And if you watched our video last week, I actually liked the Texans to pick up that underdog victory. And after the first 15 minutes, I was looking fantastic, but turns out the chiefs turned things on for those last three quarters. I don't think the chiefs are going to have as much trouble this week as they did last week. And I expect the chiefs to win 
against Tennessee at home. Tennessee have been fantastic. As I said before, they've been brilliant in the playoffs thus far, but how many times can they win as underdogs and beat these top-seeded teams? I don't expect them to beat the Chiefs. I expect the Chiefs win and the Chiefs to make the playoff or to make the Super Bowl, that is, for the first time since 1969. Now, to put that in a little bit of context, that's 51 years ago that the Chiefs last made the Super Bowl. The Chiefs won that Super Bowl, Super Bowl IV. Uh, they won it that year, and that season was the season prior to the AFL-NFL merger. So a lot of history going on and a lot of time between those Kansas City Chiefs making the Super Bowl, uh, those making the Super Bowl previously, and making the Super Bowl this season. At least that's my pick to make the Super Bowl from the AFC. Kansas City Chiefs there to win. Now, let's take a look over at the NFC because this week I'm going to give you both picks rather than just giving you the uh, giving you a few and sending you over to the blog. So, Packers taking on the San Francisco 49ers. Again, both of these teams burning red hot. And as we can see, the Packers picking up a win against the Seattle Seahawks last week in the divisional round. And the Packers did have to hang on to that late as the Seahawks made a comeback there in the end of the game. And we'll go over the Niners. Niners beating San, uh, being the Minnesota Vikings pretty handily and uh, really, really holding that Minnesota rushing game to uh, to limited yards. I believe it was something under 20 yards, if I remember correctly, uh, that the San Francisco 49ers defense held the Vikings to uh, 20, under 20 yards on the ground. So I really like the Niners in this game. They're playing at home. Uh, the weather will not be a factor like it could possibly be in Green Bay with cold or snowy weather. So I do like the 49ers on this. Again, I like Aaron Rodgers, but the Niners defense is just too good right now. And I think that they will snuff out that uh, Packers team. And uh, if they limit that rushing game and they force Aaron Rodgers to throw 90% uh, of the game, I don't see the Packers being able to overcome the 49ers. Now let's look at the head-to-head -head because we can see there back in November, the Niners and the Packers went at it. And you can see that San Francisco won at home 37 to eight. And that defense uh, stuffed the Packers holding them to just eight points. Last two games in the last two seasons, we also see that the home team won in this situation. And before that, the Niners were actually quite bad. Uh, with the Packers picking up a couple of wins in 2015 and 2016. Now, again, like I said, I'm going with the 49ers on this game. I really like what the 49ers uh, are doing and how they're playing. And I'm picking 49ers, Kansas City Chiefs, Super Bowl. And I think that would be a fantastic marquee game for everybody to watch this season. So, guys, those are my picks this week. And you can go over to the VIP wall and the VIP club and get – all of this information there and uh, do your own little research. If you don't like what I have, uh, my picks, you can go over there, do some research and figure out how you want to bet and invest your money on these NFL games. Also, you could go to use the playoff simulation tool. Now we've shown you this in previous weeks with our videos here on YouTube. So you go back and do a search of the uh, Z code system channel and you'll be able to find that and you can figure out how that works and uh, you can go over to the VIP club and you can use that tool to decide which two teams will be making it to the Super Bowl. So good luck this weekend, guys, with your NFL betting. We've got two huge games, the AFC Championship game and the NFC Championship game, and it's all come down to this. So good luck with your sports investing, and we will see you next week when we are set for the Super Bowl. Later, guys.